okay we'll start with chapter 1 and that is matter in our surroundings the first question that comes to our mind is what is matter now anything that has mass and which occupies space is called matter now what do you mean by occupies space this means that it has some volume so we can say anything that has some mass and that has some volume can be called matter now we'll try to understand this with some examples first we'll try to draw a cone what is a cone and how it can be drawn we'll take a triangle and we'll take a circle right we'll try to adjust this circle over here like this and then we'll just remove this line from here i know that you people can draw a better cone than myself and what do we have inside a cone many people of your class really love what we are going to put inside this cone we are going to put inside this cone some very very delicious ice cream right so let me put into this cone some very delicious ice cream yeah so this cone is now filled up with ice cream now this ice cream it has some mass say 10 grams or 100 grams or 200 grams and it is occupying some space that is it is taking up some volume so this ice cream can be considered to be some kind of matter similarly let us take another example suppose we have a bucket okay so i know that this is not going to be the most beautiful bucket in the world but still it can be considered to be a bucket and inside this bucket we are going to put some water right so inside this bucket we are going to put some water and to make it a real little bit realistic i'll just remove this line a bit and then i'll be putting some water into this bucket yeah okay so this water inside this bucket has been put and so this water has some mass it may be say 1 kg or 2 kg or 5 kg and it is taking up some space that is space of half the bucket and so since this water has some mass and it is taking up some space that is it is having some volume so we can consider this water to be some kind of matter so in this video we have seen what is matter anything that has some mass and it takes up some space is called matter we will take a quick pause and will come up in the next video with more details about matter. See you in just a minute.